Preparations began today to search inside the Sewaho ferry for nine passengers who are still missing. Coming up on three years since the ship sank off Korea's southwestern coast on April 16, 2014. Workers are using drones to take photos and video of the exterior of the ship, after which they'll pressure wash the hull. The Sewaho is corroded significantly since it was pulled out of the ocean and exposed to the air, and structures inside it have collapsed, making it dangerous for workers to go in. Officials are considering cutting holes in the ferry at the bow and stern so workers can get in as soon as possible to clear away mud and other debris.